So yes, you guys are in the Grand Library of Aguna, sent forward down into the 195th floor of the library, thanks to the dragon uh, Maranzio Santaloria. And you find yourselves in the next level of the library and you hear skittering about the turning of mechanical parts and rhythmic stomping, kind of muffled by the various different books that line the walls. Whoa. Here you are. Whoa, whoa! And you can see ahead of you a uh, similar looking teleportation circle, although tinted a different color than the one that you are standing on. And every now and then a book appears. And then a some sort of little skittering scorpion-like construct goes, picks it up, and starts to log it in the various different uh, bookshelves. It's like a big hmm. Bitcoin mining facility. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, I say since this is going, this is a hostile environment, we're going to go ahead and immediately roll for initiative, so that you guys can take your turns doing what it is that you wish to do. I'm still a snake. Yeah. Oh, I thought it wore off by now. Uh, I can have it wear off. It only lasts an hour. I'm not in control of that. <laughs> Help! Oh. <laughs> there we are. Word of Fritz, who is going to stand aside while the other one also stands aside in the hallway to say, no, you go first. <laughs> After uh, you. I don't really have anything important to do first, so I'll, I'll stand aside. All right. So yes, Buck, you're up first. How do you wish to explore the library? Um, well, I maybe wanted to try something here, but it doesn't really rely on me, so I don't know if I can maybe pass my turn. You can. Um, yeah, what's your but plan? I'll, but I'll, I was going to, because I think they mentioned this. I'll turn to Fritz. Fritz, didn't you say you had lack of... Did, did you say you had gotten a better access card than than the rest of us? Yeah. Or you got, like, I'm a special sure this, library card. This goes a bit further than what... You don't that think would it would access. Yeah. You don't think no, those if... down there, those robots would listen to you if you commanded them? Uh wasn't it only to full 30? 60. Yeah, well, yours 60, Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, no. I'm pretty sure if the dragon isn't allowed down here, uh, my card isn't going to do shit. I'm going to smash those little creatures <laughs> then. I, I I don't know if they're oh. hostile or not. What 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 are we thinking here? <laughs> Well, we were warned that we were trespassing beyond our station. It was likely that everything in the library would become hostile to us at this area. I've got no problem with smashing. I just wanted to make sure that it's that is the plan <laughs> that we fight. <laughs> okay, um, I'll draw a big blind, and then I have 50 feet of movement speed. <laughs> as, uh, uh, can I move right? I'll move here past this thing, and then. Ooh, okay. But yes, you move down there, and uh, you do see more of the library, including a few humanoid constructs with massive stone-like shields in either arm. Mm -hmm. And they can't see, uh, just to check with the rest of the, the science team, you can't see the, the, the things I'm seeing right now, no, can you? Doesn't look like it. All right, I turn around and say, I'm surrounded, and then I'm going <laughs> to rage <laughs> as a bad section. They're not even uh, hostile. Yeah, do they, re I mean, do they react when I... Uh, they notice you, and it seems as though they turn kind of their torso, and then their legs follow, Jeez. and they are going to begin their march towards you uh, yeah, once it's I'm their just turn, not which means I'm going to roll initiative for them. Chance to do that. Hold on, I'm looking yep. at my specialty oh, wow. okay. wild sir. Well then, uh, guess they're very, very slow. Yep. Uh, <laughs> did that roll five? Whenever a creature hits you with an attack roll before your rage ends, that creature takes 1d6 uh, force damage. Whoa. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, can I get my, I'll give myself a little. Yeah, put a little symbol on it. A little symbol on it. Yeah. Um, yeah. I have 10 feet of movement speed, although I still have my bugbear arm, so I don't have enough to get to these other creatures, but I'm just going to, I'm just gonna maybe take a thwack at this little this little guy here. Okay. If, if that is. If that yes, is you okay. may. You see that it's so. very small, like it's about dog sized, and uh, you You're know attacking the clerk. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you may take your swing. Wait. Okay. Uh. Ooh, nice. Yeah. Easily, you take a uh. smack down. This thing like almost doesn't even know your presence until Big Blind just. Crushes it, springs go, 
and it, it crumbles into pieces. You oh, completely okay. annihilate uh, it. Okay. Uh, so I have five feet of movement, so I think I can still hit this one here with my long range. All right. Yeah, you may. Uh, yeah, sure. You can move between attack actions. All right. Yeah, yeah. same thing. This one just <laughs> completely busts into a, a confetti of parts and screws and gears. Okay, the, that's um. You have be... smashed what is called a kitty widget. Oh, that feels like maybe we weren't correct to murder it. <laughs> I I told everyone what my plan was going to be. If someone <laughs> I, wanted, we, to... no, 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 we were all working on the same information. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> yeah, one of us is a is a. I, I have gathered no information snake. since we got to the library. <laughs> Net zero well, these information. These ones are dead, and now I am okay. in, in my turn. Okay. Uh, as you smash them, like the buzzing sound left over from the kind of leftover parts rings kind of around, and you hear the skittering of like uh, the other kitty widgets kind of in the walls uh, <laughs> stop suddenly, and then. In unison, chi -chi 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 -chi. and then they all look at you. You can see that they're all on the bookshelves, and they look to you, and they start advancing. Oh, I'm really <laughs> surrounded. <huh? laughs> okay. Word. Um, yep. All right. Yeah, I'll, I'll start up next. Yeah. We're fighting. Okay. <laughs> Are you, as a flying snake, you head towards some of them. Yeah. Now, you will be oh, able to reach them. Hold on, let me put a little icon to indicate that they're higher up on the walls. Let's see. Can I not get to them as a tiny little guy? No, you can. I'm just, uh, you reminded me to put something on them to indicate that they're higher up and may are out of, like, floor melee range. What's the command to roll? Is it slash roll? Slash roll or slash R. Okay, yeah. Yeah, whatever. I'll just remind you guys that they're up on the bookshelves. Woo! Ooh, nice. Yeah, that'll hit. Uh, they're immune to poison damage, aren't they? Uh, let me see. Um, yes, they are. They're constructs then, yeah. So I do one piercing damage. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. I'll fly back out of the ring. Because <laughs> I don't provoke attacks of opportunity. Nice. Mm, that's very interesting. But I can only do one damage. Yeah, it pings off. Death and by you a thousand a cuts. Actually, no, I'm, I'm aggressive. I'm coming back. <laughs> Psych. <laughs> you only have Absolute one attack. Actually, right. <laughs> well, these guys. That's it. Yeah. That's my turn. Those are the guys I saw. Uh, those guys. I'll, I'll go ahead and let you know. These are Clockwork Stone Defenders. They are sentries made to patrol the inner parts of the bottom floors of the Grand Library. Mm -hmm. Fritz, your turn. Uh, I'm going to... Uh, fire at the construct next to Word in front of them. All right, thanks to your crossbow's range, you can easily target it. Go ahead. Ooh, yeah, easy. And you easily, yep, ping, it smashes to pieces right before Word, and the pieces fall to the floor. Oh, oh I forget. I get two attacks at this level, don't I? You do. I, it's been a while. I forget. Yeah. Oh, yeah, then the one behind him. Let's go again. The one that just died. Mm -hmm. We go again. Mm <laughs> hmm. Ooh, that one goes a little wide and just lodges into one of the books. Foom! And the flame starts to kind of go up, but then it just shoo, sizzles out. Oh, oh, yeah, As you remember... I that I had fire on this thing. No, it's okay. Uh, to remind you guys, uh, Maranzio mentioned that these books have all been... Uh, all have an enchantment on them to make sure that they don't catch on fire. Because that would be very devastating to the library. <laughs> Anything you wish to do with your bonus action? Decanter uh, of Endless Water. I... Can I actually use the rest of my movement to try to get on top of the okay. Uh, Not on top, since they go all the way up to the ceiling, but you can oh, fly there is up. no top. I'm sorry, it, look, it looks like they were on top. Right? No, yeah, it's just because of the asset that I use. But uh, okay, you can... No, no, I'm good then. All right. Leira, your turn. All right. Uh, well, I can't see shit, so allow me to move. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Polymorph is concentration. By the it way. is, yeah. Uh, well, I, yeah, you know that. I figure I'll be dropping it in a minute. Yeah. Um, 
Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna, to start off, use a resource that isn't non-renewable for a change. I'm gonna attempt to hit uh, that guy with a thorn whip. Okie dokie. Uh, oh, now I'm really f feeling the struggle of not having a You know what? Okay, sorry. Uh, for the fucks at home. I've been, yeah, I really like this. Uh, it's given, um, uh, Phoenix what? Wright almost. Oh, I, just swinging out here. I was thinking of a completely different situation, but no. yeah, Phoenix Wright is definitely. Um, did that go through? All right, yes, that'll hit 19. Perfect. Okay, so it's just 2d6 damage. Uh, which. There we go. Okay, yeah, yeah that'll okay. do it. Yeah. And that construct also falls apart. These things are very fragile. Cool. Yep, you thorn whip it and it breaks apart in pieces, falls to the floor. Perfect. Anything else? Um, nope, that's my turn. Okay, now it's the Construct's turn. Uh, and they, uh, the kitty widgets start to crawl down and uh, surround you, Buck. Mm -hmm. They stop what they're doing immediately at your hostility as well as everybody else. Start to surround you. Oh, that's not right. There we go. Does anything happen to that one when it goes onto the portal? Uh, no. It uh, steps over the portal. You can see that it doesn't seem to be affected by it at all. Got it. And, let's see, they all come about there. And you can see the two Clockwork Stone Defenders walk up. Gung, 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 heavy footsteps. And both of them say in unison, in common, you are in a restricted area. Please present your library card. Uh, can I, you want me to? I'll <laughs> yeah, take you out can. my library card. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if I can, as a reaction, take yeah, out my. Yeah, I'll, I'll uh, say you can, yeah. Yeah, I'll take out my library card. I'm sorry, you do not have access to this area. Please leave. And then they both start to head towards you uh, and get within melee range. This is your only warning. <gasps> Malicious intent. <laughs> so. There's a lot of them. Over none here. of them attack yet. But now, Buck, it's your turn again. You're gonna start pushing you. Um, I don't have a ton of options here. Uh, I guess I could walk away and <laughs> let Lara like hit them with a big thing, but I don't necessarily want to waste my turn. Uh, we have five I more floors of this we need to get through. I don't know how many big things I want to burn on floor one. You. you if it's you want to try my card, you can, but I no, doubt it will work. That's very okay. Well. I'm just going to try and smack at this one, I suppose. Uh, yeah, I'll try and hit at that that boy. With, and I'm gonna attack Rec. Uh, there's a lot of people around me. I'm gonna attack normally. <laughs> okay, which one are you attacking? Uh, this one here. The Stone Defender. Okay. Yep, that'll be enough. You crack through its heavy armor. Ooh, it nice. is going to be 15 damage instead of 15. 15 okay. Boosh, you crack through. And this thing is not as tough as you would expect as uh, this thing starts to spark and kind of a few pieces fall. You can tell by looking at it and attacking it as well that uh, the reason for its fragility is because this thing is very old. Mm. Uh, I'll, I'll try and uh, smack at it. Again. All right. Okay, that will almost do it. It is falling apart. It is sparking, and it's like, please leap, please leap, please leap, please leap. <laughs> All right, it's gonna be another. Th it's gonna be thirteen damage. Oh, thirteen. Okay, never mind. It falls apart. It's broken. Yeah. <laughs> it, its head just bursts off of its torso. <laughs> Yay. Um. I know tourist. I'll turn to face this other one, and then I'll end my turn. Okay. Word. <laughs> You're still I a flying fly snake. Fly to Lara and say something that only a flying snake would say. You're stronger than me. <laughs> and I will use a help action. Huh. I'll just like oh. wrap myself around her arm. Aw, thanks. Cute. All right. Awesome, Fritz. That yeah, motherfucker. That All right. <laughs> Pew. Pew. Yes. Pew. It, Ooh, you are picking them off like flies. Ooh, kill them. <laughs> okay, Ooh, and then the one next to Buck there. Mm -hmm. pew. Yeah, another pew, just Whoa. pinging them off. Well done. It's going okay. crazy. These um, things are not meant for combat. Hmm. I think I'm pretty good right now. All right. 
Lara, your turn. You have the help action. Hmm. Huh. Cool. So. So that means I do what I do next at advantage. What? Right? Yeah. Any uh, like roll that has you rolling a, a d20 is yeah, that it's at a advantage. d20 roll. Yep. Okay. So okay. So that includes spell attacks. Mm-hmm. Um. Yeah. Okay. Then I'm going to uh scooch a little bit further forward. Uh, and I'm going to attempt to thorn whip this guy. All right. Because the more damage I can do through cantrips, the better. Okay. Uh, whoa. I don't know why it just rolled three dice. Sorry. Oh, that's okay. We'll just. <laughs> so many dice. We'll just not take I mean, the I think right I hit one, it. But yes, you, uh, you would hit. Yes. Okay. Uh, so let me just. Okay. Stop it. Why does it keep doing this to me? <laughs> this is so embarrassing. It pings off a little bit. You scratch it up yeah. a little bit, but this thing is still standing. I should just start hitting things with my sword. All right, is that your turn? All right, then? that's yeah, that's me sorted. Okay, uh, the stone defender and the rest of the constructs now are going to start attacking. So, the uh, kitty widgets are gonna now surround you, Buck, and start mm-hmm. nipping at your heels. Okay. So you are going to you... take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. How many times do I have to roll a d6? Because once they hit me, they take they one d6. Die. And oh, uh, roll. Of my... Roll seven d6. There's one. Okay. You can do them all together, and then you two. Can just yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll just count three, them individually. Oh, okay. Four. Wow. Four, <laughs> five. Six. I think the six is seven. Seven. Okay. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so all of them are gonna nip at your heels. Let's see. Blah, 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 blah. I'm rolling a bunch of dice. Man, what is this? Warhammer? I think that's ha, only ha, ha, if ha. they hit. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't feel like no one laughed at the Warhammer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so three of them. It, it's good that he rolled them all just in case, though. Yeah. Three of them are gonna hit you, and you are going to take uh, nine, uh, reduced to four piercing damage as they try to bite at you and all three of them get zapped and just bust open. Uh, The other three are going to miss and the stone defender is going to attack as well as he takes his big old shield and slams it down on you. Okay. Okay, and it is going to hit four... Um, also, I, I will say, I, oh, never mind. We, you guys, what you were talking about. I was confused for a second. Never mind. Forget it. All good. Uh, you are going to take twelve, reduced to six, bludgeoning damage, and he is also going to get zapped for a little bit as well. Okay. Okay. Next, Buck, your turn again. I'm gonna hit that boy with the thing. Hit the boy with the I'm thing. Gonna, I'm gonna do it. Ooh, nice. Uh, yes. Ten damage total. Ten damage. This thing is hanging on by a thread. Uh, I will make another swing. Uh, unfortunately, that it pulls up the oh, shield uh, and oh, before. Uh-huh. Oh, sorry. I I still have my lucky points. Oh, you may um, use it then. My sorry, I, I I guess I should say that because I'm supposed to decide what to do. Uh, before before I, you, you know, I'm what, I'm what, too hasty. You gotta go ahead. Me, that's yeah. fine. Um, I'll try and be quicker next time. But actually, I'm not gonna use it there because I'm I'm just gonna hope that someone kills it before. So I'm not gonna use. <laughs> no, I'm. I oh, need to nice. slow down. You go. Uh, yeah, I, that. So I'll take the. I've already taken the damage. Um, I'm not gonna r- lucky roll, so I will end my turn. All right. Uh, word. Word. Snake word. All right. I can do this. Looks <laughs> weak. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that soft twenty will hit. I'll just send it. <laughs> just <laughs> typed in one. <laughs> yeah, I just typed in one. Oh, you don't roll for the piercing damage. I choose my no, damage. It's one piercing damage. <laughs> Literally it's, one. It's one okay. plus a certain amount yeah. of poison. Yeah. Uh, I see. You. Crunch into the hard, gotcha. rocky <laughs> Please kill it. stone shield, and you're able to chip off like a pebble. Well done. Oh no, no, hell yeah! It's so cool. <laughs> I'm good at the game, <laughs> Fritz. Uh, well, I guess you were relying on me. Um, Taking more pop shots. Perish. Perish. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Hold on, let me roll. Everyone's no, counting on no. me. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh no. <Okay>. Wait. <laughs> Am I back? Are we back? <laughs> uh, you 
shoot at it. Phew! And like, word, you like look back proudly at the damage mm -hmm. that you've done, and it phew, <laughs> zooms over your Snake head, smile. nearly taking out your snaky head, and just poof into the bookshelf. It just narrowly missed you. Layra just hears like um. a scream. <laughs> uh, scared. <laughs> Don't like. <laughs> It's all right. You'll just turn back into normal word. Uh, I don't know what that is. Uh, <laughs> I try again. <laughs> all right, let's try again. Okay, okay that one's going to hit, and that's going to take care of that one. Well done. Hey, listen. I <laughs> don't think I did the worst there. All right, Lyra, your turn. I'll go. <sighs> yeah, I'm a little bit tired of not doing any damage, so I'm going to wild shape into a brown bear. <laughs> All right, Yay. brown Unfortunately, bear. Unfortunately, it's an action, so I can't attack. Uh, but yes, my concentration does stay unless I purposefully drop it. I don't know, does Word want me to turn Word back? I, I don't know who Word is, I'm a snake. <laughs> I'm the snake man. <laughs> there I'm is no more fly. Word. <laughs> this is fascinating. Um, okay. But is I it... think I did notice that you just chipped a pebble off of the stone thing, and I'm like, oh, okay, all right. <laughs> All right, <laughs> here, let's trade, and uh, I'll drop concentration on polymorph intentionally. Oh, <laughs> I fall to the ground. Not that I far. I was in hell. Where am I? <laughs> oh, you big. Oh, yeah, let me mark off my slot I spent on polymorph. How'd you make yourself big? I wanted to uh, I, I made her big. That's, oh, yay, because I'm a brown I've bear now. Him. I'm a large beast. <laughs> Oh, hello. I look up at this thing. <laughs> the buck you've changed. Oh, no. yeah. oh I, I, really, I really should read my bonus actions more. Read the, peep this. Oh. Uh, you gain, you ignore oh, the loading my. property. Oh. Being within five feet of a hostile creature doesn't Whoa. pose disadvantage. When you use crazy. an attack. Yeah, I remember I uh, helping you pick so this can... feet. Oh yeah, you got Yeah, so I, I I didn't realize. So I can use my bonus attack, a uh, bonus action to do another attack. Yes, but uh, you can't do that cool. and your plain planer warrior at the same time because they both take a yeah, bonus action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, cool, cool, cool. If I wanted to do three attacks in a turn, well, I'll try that out probably in my next turn if yeah. it doesn't kill them all. But... Those are both good. <laughs> Thankfully, I think Lyra is done. I can't attack because I've wild shaped and that takes an action. All right, well then, uh, it is going to be the Oh, but let me move up to, actually, sorry. Uh, yeah, that's okay. Now that I am big, let us... Mm, actually, I can't. I say, I, need to move. I have a home rule that you can move through allies. It's fine. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> flanking. <laughs> Fair flanking. Awesome. Yeah, no, that is an official rule. You can move through them, but you can't well, end your turn on their oh, space. Ah. Uh, never mind. Mm -hmm. Now then, uh, the cock, uh, clockwork stone defender, seeing that uh, it is surrounded, is going to slam the ground. So, uh, Word, Buck, and Lyra, I'm going to need oh. all of you to make a constitution saving throw. Why do I get into melee with things? <laughs> I'm so offended. Um, Buck is the only one who doesn't save. Everybody else saves. So everybody Yay. else, you don't get knocked off your feet. And you are going to take four bludgeoning damage. Buck, you're also going to take four because you're raging. Um, yeah, yeah, okay. However, you oh, are you going take, to... You need to take four damage? I think so. Not you, you Fritz. Don't, you don't. You don't. Okay. You're, you're too far away from yeah, the you're too far away. effect. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. You said everyone but Buck, so I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. No, everyone I'm around the failed, construct. So. Uh, Buck, you are going to... So, yeah, you're going to be knock prone. <laughs> no! And these two are going to nip at you some more. They're going to do it with advantage, I suppose. Yes, they are. And both of them are going to hit. So you can roll me 2d6 to see if, how much they get zapped. Uh, <laughs> see if you're high rolling still. Yeah, I was, I was rolling really well. Oh my gosh, yeah. All right. Ooh. Well, that's 2d6. Oh, 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 never mind. Sorry, two and a three. My mistake. Three. Okay. Uh, so they get zapped as they nip at you. And you are going to take a whopping two damage. No. Total. No. Okay, but I just realized I had temp HP, but it was only two, so I'll just get rid of that now. From the eclair. Yeah. My donut. No, the donut. <laughs> oh, the We're, donut. Yeah, the donut. Now you're trying to get back. The, relax. Stale. Relax. I, I really can't believe I'm getting. I get. I got roasted for that. <laughs> you're no one checks up. the. We don't. I, we don't check the the 
<laughs> shelf date on the potions we drink, do we? No. Just, a, but, uh, but, uh, but yes, the and moment eclair. that I have a donut. Just as magical as a magic it's potion. It wasn't the eclair. It's it wasn't like... the eclair. It was the donut. It's... That's like being like, oh, I can eat this can of, I can eat this bread because, oh, we have a can of beans. I'm sure they last the same. Yeah. Okay. Twinkies Lyra don't have an expiration a, date. We just, one of us was just a flying snake and the other one is and now a bear and we're fighting robots in a magical library. If the, in this magical world, the donuts can be shelf stable in my backpack. Who's to say? Are shelf you? I, did you, you hear the DM? Did you hear the DM decide <laughs> that it, you know, that it like, was stale? Time passes. Magic does. I, I don't know. The word, the word of God says that yes, that is possible, just not yours. Dang it. Okay. I should, I should Your knapsack isn't refrigerated. <laughs> I, Are you saying your ex-wife would pump tons and tons of preservatives in her to her wonderful home? Yeah, face. what you trying to say, Buck? <laughs> no! Yeah. I'm going She's to always trying to make things last longer here. than they should. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Sorry. Mr. Demo, Good. cut me out of the, cut me out of the campaign. I didn't mean how to post. Buck out of this. <laughs> yeah, wreck on me eating Sorry. the donut. <laughs> that was a reasonable tangent. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, and I end my turn. By the way, <laughs> wait, who's, wait, is it my? Oh, yeah, my it turn. is your turn oh. now. Oh, sorry. Um, I eat a second donut. Um, <laughs> no, I will use eat that second my, deviled egg. I will use my half my movement to get up, and then I will attack uh, recklessly first with um, uh, on the big guy. Big guy. All right. Yeah, that'll do it. He falls to pieces. You smash him to bits. And then I will attack recklessly on uh, the one directly to my left. Uh, yeah. Another very that. easy small fry. Uh, and I won my turn. Word. You're back in your normal form. I pull out Black Hawk. Ooh. And I, I huh? just, like, kiss the top of it. It's my crossbow, my magic crossbow. <laughs> and I'll just launch a single little thing. At the yeah, last easy. Guy. Boosh. Dunzo. <laughs> Oh, I missed this. <laughs> okay. I'll Are, end. We okay. Still gonna stay Are we done? In. Okay. Uh, did we do it? <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we're. I think we got most okay. of them. Layra, that's <laughs> not how I thought that would be. Oh. What man. happened? I didn't know this was a library. I thought it was like a weird forest. <laughs> I don't uh, think Lara we... can respond. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Well. Lara's looking rather unimpressed, but that's it. <laughs> Lara, can you still read while you're a bear? Shake your head up and down. If the answer is yes. And you Lara can looks me. more unimpressed. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I. We spoke I... to the dragon, and he gave me a weird look. Oh, sorry, I cut you off. No, no, it's fine. Uh, I nod. Uh, my mental stats okay. don't change when I wild shape, so right. <laughs> this is a very you interesting experience. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess we should stick together and look around. I guess, realistically, we're trying to get to the next floor. I mean, we, is the plan to get to the final floor, to, or should we just start looking at books? How deep are we? What do you mean the final floor? <laughs> oh, yeah, there's five floors that we need, we need to, that we're not allowed to be on. As a tiny um, library. Well, the library's much bigger. We're actually on five of like 200 or something like that. Oh my god. Cool. I'm gonna start <laughs> looking around to see if I can find any books. Yeah, Buck, you can give me a general perception check to just like scan the books and see what you find. Can I use my magic awareness? Uh, it sends out like a pulse of- In like 60 feet, right? Mm-hmm. Right, okay, yes, you can. Um, ba 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 ba. Choo, 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 choo. So, you send out the pulse. Uh, in the bookshelves, there are a few magical books, and scanning them over, you can tell that these are just teaching books that have not been published yet, but they're going through a review uh, when you kind of pick them up and scan through them. So, they, you know, need to be scrutinized before they're allowed to uh, be published in academia. And the NDA section. Yeah. yeah, and you also sense enchantment spells on some books kind of around you as well, like this pile of books on the floor right here. I'll let everyone know about the enchantment spell in the books. Any Anything coming off of this? Yes, the, uh... you know, these are wind crystals. These are providing ventilation and cooling into the building since uh, it is completely sealed to the outside by magical means. It's oh. just to keep things nice and pleasant. And yes, word, when you go over there, you can see another patrolling clockwork stone defender. 
Uh, can I make a stealth check before he sees me? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Okay. Oh yeah, you're fine. Yeah. You're small enough. You're hiding behind that stack <laughs> of books. You're it's okay. Kind of meandering, and I'm like, oh. But also <laughs> oh, I, hiding what? behind that stack There's of books. Uh, word. Oh. Because you are so stealthy and you don't trigger it, you can see that the stack of books is like gently breathing. What? Huh? You said it was mimic. Enchanted. Is it a mimic? <laughs> yes, I did say they were enchanted. Uh, breathing is the maybe uh, not the correct term, but they are like ever like so gently un undulating. Yeah, undulating. Like no, like no, fluttering, no. like in a breeze. Undulating, I realize, is now worse. Than breathing. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't know. Okay, you see some subtle movements. Be doing. Yeah, you breathing. see some subtle movements Fuck. among the books, and I will reveal that these are a swarm of animated books. Perhaps something laid as a trap or a protector of some kind. Don't mm. freaking touch these things. What Do does that, that top one say? Did you get um? Oh, sorry. Uh, can I read the top of the first animated book? Uh, you look at the top of the first animated book, and it almost looks like... It's like when you look at AI art, where it's like, oh. it looks fine at a glance, mm. but then the longer you look at it, the more wrong it seems, where it's like, oh, that's common writing, right? Wait, no, it's not. That's not a letter I recognize. What the heck? Oh, that's fucking weird. Why, <laughs> why is it like that? I like squint and rub my eyes. Um, I don't think this actually says anything. I think um, this is a. I, I'm like, oh, how could I indicate to you that I'm lying? I'm winking. I'm winking at you like really. I'm like, what? this is a uh, really normal book, uh, <laughs> but I don't think we should touch it at all because it's just a plain old normal book. And I'm like winking at words so he get so he hopefully gets. I, I look like dumbfounded at you because I'm the one who's trying to explain that it's like fancy and oh, magic, and you're like, oh, okay. word, it's fancy and magic, and I'm like. Yeah. Yes, yes. Oh, I did my yeah, magic awareness correct. thing. I know that it's I know that it's not real. I thought, I thought you let us know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm yeah. stepping back slowly. Yeah. There's a guy with the big sh actually, you know what? I could probably just go take him out. I'm going to go do that actually. What? Do I do I get anything going on with these? Here? Uh, you see the, this uh Yeah, they're like newly unpublished books or some of them are published but like out of date and oh, yeah. they are to be kind of stored away for safekeeping and such. And actually, you do find one that you recognize. Oh. Uh, you you know, rather, not recognize, but you note the title and you find, da 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 da. Just a, rom uh, just a lost <laughs> romance, a critique <gasps> of Lost in a Drift. No. no. No chance you wrote all this. <laughs> Controversial media reviewer. Yes. Uh, if you would like, I can, I can read through this for, for everyone. <laughs> Or if you want yes. to continue. Oh, okay. can I? Oh, are you just showing this to me? Uh, no, to everyone. Uh, but oh, okay. This that, is that's, incredible. That's more for the player's uh, uh, benefit rather than the uh, the characters. But yes, a critical analysis piece on the romance novel Lost in a Drift by Chingles McBallister IV. The author of the, <laughs> of the critique, Beatrice Rivera, is a very well-known and controversial media reviewer who has garnered many different viewpoint, uh, differing viewpoints of her analysis over the years. Just as many people find her words law as there are those who find them blasphemous. Casual readers just find her writing enjoyable to read in and of itself regardless of the subject. A random passage in the magazine reads as follows. Though the romance between the two leads is most definitely believable and engrossing, I question the way McBallister insists on adding unnecessary drama between the two that could easily be solved with a simple conversation. It leaves a frustrating reading experience to what would otherwise be an extremely compelling character exploration between two individuals, I misspelled that, who have grown apart <laughs> over the years. Also, I hate the mimic mascot Chester. He's very annoying. Fuck Chester. Are you an idiot, Mr. McBallister? How did you not know this would be a terrible idea? The magazine continues with similar tonal whiplash between well-articulated thoughtful critique and ad hominem against the author, though unclear if the latter is merely for comedic effect or genuine parasocial hatred. There's a note attached to the book that says, clear for publishing, distribute on the first Friday of next month. I pocket it. I, I put it away. <laughs> <You did. laughs> wow. No one needs to know how bad that book was. <laughs> this is, I liked Chester. This is bull. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, word. You what? wish to sneak up on the uh, yeah. the construct, okay? If I'm not getting in anybody's way, I want to just do a really healthy sneak attack there and just wipe it. Yeah, out. let's see with advantage. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, is the, it, can I make a sneak attack roll? Let's do that. 
Nice. Well, there you go. That should have advantage, but that should hit, right? Yeah, if you what? if you do hit, that will be your sneak attack damage. Oh no. Oh, that's the okay. Sorry, thank you. Yeah. I, I confused myself. Yes, let's do this. When your sneak attack is so high you mistake it for an attack roll. Yeah, that'll yeah, do it. You say. cut it down in one single swipe as it falls apart before you. And as it's falling apart, it's like, please present your library corp. <laughs> I don't even know what a library card is. <laughs> I see another one. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, uh, Fritz and Leira, what are you guys up to? Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Um, I'm kind of assuming we probably need to go deeper. Uh, I, I, the player, don't remember. We could go left or right. Mm. Should we split up? This always worked out. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Lara kind of raises a big paw and kind of wobbles it uncertainly. <laughs> well, if we go as a team to the other side, then we can efficiently explore faster, Smiles. That's fine. I mean, I don't think we're the fours are too big, so just holler if you need help, I guess. Big bear shrug. <laughs> you, All right, you, wanna... you, you can be bear team two. And we're going to be bear team one. What? We'll be buck team hashtag number one. Don't mock my voice. <laughs> <laughs> so in case uh, you need a reminder Sorry. on the objective. Um, so um, in case you need a reminder mm -hmm. of the objective, uh, the main thing Maranzio wants is the first draft of the war with Diosia. Uh, but he also said that you can just gather whatever information you feel might be important and useful, and likely whatever's on the most bottommost floor, you'll know it when you see it. Mm -hmm. Bottommost floor is where Classic. we're aiming. Right, that's what I thought. We, we're not expected to be finding it on this floor, we're expected to go down further. Yes, but that, there okay. might be things that prove useful along the way. Well, I'm not averse to doing a little bit of searching, so. As a fella. Oh, there's a fella? There's a fella. Oh, yes, you do there's see that there is a sentinel. Uh, oh, geez. Maybe we should maybe well, we should go back to initiative. Okay. Uh, well, we'll do this uh, so that the ladies can... The, the lady and the non-descript gender neutral can... Uh, <laughs> the crew. The crew. <laughs> and the boys. The homies. It scares me that I can't see you on my map anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys okay? Really There's a bear like, loose I'm in the line. I'm confused. Which one's the lady? Uh, the bear, <laughs> clearly. The can't you, you're can't you tell from her I feminine okay. figure? <laughs> I've just got a bow in my hair. <laughs> oh. That way we know it's a female bear. This bear has <laughs> beautiful <laughs> eyelashes. <laughs> but yes, you do see a stone defender down the hallway who is just patrolling and doesn't seem to have taken note of you yet. Should I shoot it? Uh. I'm looking to see if you nod. I, well, I'm inclined to just trundle in there and very slowly hit it, uh, but I mean, I could weaken it. It's not a bad idea. <laughs> but also, you go before me, so All right. yeah. All right. Very nice. Uh, because we just rediscovered, do you wish to use your planar warrior feature? Yeah, it would be fun to try it. All right. Um, so uh, your practice attack. It. Yeah, you may roll an additional d8. There you go. Oh, there you go. Okay, so yes, you fire upon it and it ping, knocks off a decent piece of armor off of it and you have a second attack if you wish to use it. And it's going to be at advantage as well, I forgot to mention, because you are surprising this guy. Attacking right, out of the I shadows. Do it again. Uh, once again with advantage, because uh, yeah, you roll again because you're doing it with advantage. Mm-hmm. All right, that one will nice. hit. Okay, and yeah, that'll take care of it. Boom. Two Ooh, shots nice. straight into it, and it's done for. Good job. There we go. Stuff. Very cool. <laughs> now, if you do wish to move, you can oh, as actually, well. Yeah, yeah, I have some movement. You reminded me. Oh, where is my roller gone? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go up to the shiny. <laughs> the the air crystal. Yeah. 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 Oh, right. it's an air crystal. Oh, even yeah. more delicious. <laughs> That's so my thing. <laughs> yes, uh, these things are providing ventilation and cooling to the area since it is completely sealed off oh, to the I outside world. I want to put my hand on it. Yeah, it's you feel a gentle breeze. That's very nice, like sitting yeah, right I'm next happy. to the air conditioner. I'm, I'm... Mm. Yeah, I'm ending my turn here. I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> and Lyra. 
Uh, I'm going to go down and start looking through the shelves to see if I spot anything interesting. Okay, looking through the shelves. Uh, Sidling you... past the table. <laughs> yeah, looking through the shelves. That bear is And learning. you do find a book that may be of interest. Um, mm -hmm. Since you still have your mental stats, you notice uh, this book. Uh, the Wilderness Ooh. and You. Hold on. Ooh. Come on. Show everyone. A Guide to Alinthi's Wilderness. I don't know why it's cut off. Ooh. An almanac, bestiary, and overall ecological directory of the region surrounding the life tree. The creatures and plants found within seem a bit outdated, but nevertheless give you a good insight as to their behavior and place within the ecosystem. If you wish to take this book with you, it may prove useful uh, to you in your travels further inward toward Corencia through the Circle Forest, and will give you advantage on nature and animal handling checks when referred to in that region. A note is attached to the book, clear for publishing. Add note of historical context before distribution, approved as academic source. I will absolutely steal this book. All right. uh, in fact, because all my gear is wild shaped away, I will go and put this in Fritz's backpack. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. And Fritz, you just see Bear Lyra holding a book in her mouth. <laughs> In my I'm claws. Oh, in your claws. Sorry. Are, are you walking around like my blue? mouth? <laughs> of course I am. Bears can be bipedal. <laughs> Wonderful. My apologies. I didn't mean you. I... Oh, you're just trudging over to me. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen bears walk? How they like wiggle? I'm just a big guy. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm so unfazed by this because I've just been around you for so long. I'm like, oh yeah, give me the book. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. Uh, next. Part of the reason I chose this over Direwolf is that I kind of still have opposable fingers in this form. <laughs> <laughs> next will be Buck and Word, who see another stone defender. And you also see kind of along the walls some more of the kitty widgets kind of skittering about. They don't oh, seem no. to pay you much mind right now. Buck, I'm going to be honest. I'm playing this whole situation by ear. <laughs> All right, I mean, I think we should probably take out the one down there and hope that the kitty widgets don't get us. All right, that should be incredibly easy, actually. Do you want to take the lead, or I can just, like, scuttle over there? I can I can scuttle with the best of them. <laughs> All right, uh, prove it. I have 50 feet of movement, so I'm going to... Oh, God. Get, yeah, I have, I have a lot. <laughs> I forgot how long your legs were. I'm going to scuttle... You're gonna scuttle here. All right. When oh, you do, you see oh. another construct and a couple of more uh, stone defenders. <laughs> no. This one is much larger than the rest of them, almost reaching the ceiling, and seems oh, to no. be uh, paying much more close attention. Give me a stealth check, Buck. Yeah, you have reach though. Dude. Yeah, yeah. I have to roll it at disadvantage. Are you, on. You're not still raging, are you? No, no, no. Sure. That's a bummer. Okay. And when you reach there, your footsteps alert the constructs who immediately take notice of your presence. They're not mm. surprised uh, anymore. Uh, or they would be surprised if it weren't for your poor stealth, but now they <laughs> are aware of you. Uh -huh. Do you still uh, wish to attack? I wasn't able to talk myself out of this the first time. I don't know why that would be any different this time. <laughs> um, I'll turn back to Word and I'll say, get Bear Team 2. <laughs> uh, and then, uh -huh. and oh, then I, no. I guess I'll rage. Uh, the, these things are big and scary and I can't imagine they're gonna be, wait, they, are they, con like they are constructs. I can tell they're constructs. Yes, they don't you can like tell these people. are constructs. Yeah, I'm gonna okay, rage. Really quick, uh, just to clarify, you want me to run back and grab the rest of the crew? You like do you're whatever that you need to, buddy. You, uh, I, 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 I want to know, like, how are you conveying how desperate the situation you just discovered is? Should I leave? Um, <laughs> or should I join you? I'm, I'm conveying a look that tells you that not only are there other enemies, the some of those enemies are twice as large as this this current one. I could, okay. I'm so not you, if you think I'm the boss. if you think Bear Team One can handle it, I think we can. Yeah, we can probably we, we handle got it this. just fine. I'm just a big coward. Um, I'm raging. I'm definitely gonna rage because I don't have Bear Team Two. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this one. Ooh, you teleport up to thirty feet to an unoccupied space. Ooh, nothing personnel, kid. Oh, that's can a great one. Uh, yeah. Uh, in fact, do you wish I to advance will... or fall back? 
I guess I could fall back. That's probably the smarter thing to do, but I kind of want to know. I, I have a real chance to get like a good hit on on this one and then bonus dash my way out of there. Um, I'm going to go like about here maybe. Can, right. I, can I do that? We're going in deep. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah. I just want to see. Okay, so there are definitely other people here. They're um, up next. I don't even know where you are. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows where you are. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to see what was going on. I don't on. know where any of you are now. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to hit this guy. Uh, All right. I'm going to hit that guy with a regular attack. I'm not going to do it reckless. Okay, yes. That uh, so will... that's 14. Yep, that 14. will beat its armor. You're able to make a big old dent in it. I can push it five feet, so uh, but I'm not going to do that with this one because I don't want to move it out of range. I guess I still have. Actually, no, I don't have much room left. Um, I will try to hit it again. Mm -hmm. And this one will not hit. It pings off, like lifts its arm to like parry your blow. Sure, sure, sure. Okay. Um, can't really do much else, so I'll end my turn there. Okay, next is going to be what is called the Advanced Detention Drone. <laughs> and it is going to uh, hold forward its hand and say in a deep, like, bellowing robotic voice, You are in a restricted area. Please do not resist. And it is going to fire forth an orb, and I'm going to need you to make a constitution saving throw. An orb? Not an uh, orb. His orb. So it's 18 plus 5. 18. Ooh. Okay. You are encapsulated in this round magical force of orb, but you're able to burst out of it as nice. it attempted to capture you just now. Ooh. And that wasn't very yours. kind. These two, word, you can see this one marching towards this way out of your field of view. Oh. And this one is going to march this way as well. Goodbye, word. You trying to get all the glory telling me to run to our friends like a coward? <laughs> no, that's not what I'm about. I'm about filling them with arrows. Ooh. And once again, Buck is surrounded. Mm -hmm. And uh, at bursting out of the bubble, you hear a low siren come from the detention drone. These three are gonna start beating the heck out of you. Let's see. <laughs> oh, uh oh, that jump. not me. And that that low siren ring, like you, the whole floor can hear it. So I would say layer on Fritz. That is good. Well. Ooh. Okay, Buck, uh, you are going to take. Uh, before, can you let me know? Cause I have um the blade. I bought the uh. Blade mail? Uh, what is it? Blade mail? Yes. So can you let me know how much damage each one of them is doing to me? I know that sounds pedantic. But... Yeah, no, that's fine. Thank you. Uh, and did we say it was before reductions or after reduction is the amount? I think we said before reduction. Before. It, uh, okay. Reading it, uh, at least what I had written down, it says... Uh, when you take damage from any source as reaction, return the full damage back to the attacking creature. Yes. Okay. So we'll. I guess it's up to you. I, I don't. It's up to you. I say before reductions. That sounds more useful. Um, so you are going to take five, and then seven, and then six damage, which means Can this guy is going to take I... eleven. This guy's going to take fourteen. And this guy's going to take. 13. Oh no no no! I I can only do, oh, do it one? Um, once because I have okay. to use a reaction. So I'll, gotcha. I'll do it to the I'll do it to the fourteen. The fourteen. Okay. Yes. The fourteen. Mm -hmm. It you activate your blade mail. The large kind of spiky swords come out of your shoulder. Fring as it goes and bashes you, and it cuts into the stone defender's arm a little bit. And, and how much damage did you say in total I was taking? So you take five and then seven and six. So that is 18 total bludgeoning damage. Ooh, that's a lot. Okay. Yeah. And All right. this one detention drone is going to start marching towards you as well. Oh, no. And the kitty widgets are going to run up the wall, scurrying away. Okay. And this stone defender also start marching forward. Okay. Word, it's your turn. 
Oh lord, let me look at my seven You're gonna be items. mad at me when you come down here and see what I brought. <laughs> okay, the first thing I'm gonna use my base movement speed to get over here. Oh, there's a big boy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, is that big How boy? How dare he tell me to cower away from this? He is in melee range, this guy. Of me too. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna crank my black hawk. Mm -hmm. Interesting <laughs> turn of phrase. <laughs> Oh, that's not right. Not <laughs> oh, D He's rolled the, the dreaded D67. <laughs> uh, okay. So I loaded two arrows in, into the bolt of this mm -hmm. uh, hand crossbow. <laughs> D66. So, yeah, I'm, I'm currently hidden. Mm -hmm. So, so you'll have advantage. Attack roll. roll 20 was really like, that doesn't sound oh, right, wait. but I don't know enough uh, about dice to dispute it. Go ahead. Use the inspiration. What, what does that give me? Does that let me reroll? Reroll the, the full, yeah, with advantage. Okay. All right. There yes. we go. Nice. Oh, 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 that's better. Twenty-five. Okay. Actually, no. Hold on, because that's an extra one d six plus five. Uh, all right. Roll it. Because the Blackhawk lets me uh, load another. Oops. Yeah. Let's just do a one d six. I think that's how you. Okay. Roll. It's not letting me. There we go. Okay. Plus four. Not a bad amount of damage. Uh -oh. Okay. Not enough. Two heavy bolts just th 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 into the detention drone. And it uh, kind of turns its head in that direction. And it looks like it's going to head that way on its turn. That's all right. I'm fast. <laughs> Speed. Uh, I think that's everything I can do. That was my movement, bonus action, and attack. All right, Fritz, you hear that low, low drone coming from the south of where you are. Uh, I, I'm struck. I hate to admit this. I'm struggling to know which way the south is because I don't know where the sea is in this metaphorical uh, the, world. Well, I mean, south, south on the player perspective, not from the down. Yeah, oh, down. Okay, map, okay, because yeah. my brain was like. South from where I'm sitting, men here. No, or no, south no, not, from the not south in universe. <laughs> I was doing <Yeah>. gymnastics. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, south means down. I hear a humming. You hear like a low siren, like boing. Klaxons going off. Get the oh, feeling. Fuck. Maybe Why? your allies are in trouble. Yeah, maybe down one here? specific okay. of your uh, um, of your allies is in trouble. Okay, okay. I can't believe uh, something negative happened from leaving Buck and Word unattended in a <laughs> library. Ah, <laughs> uh, you can cast... I'm trying to... I'm I below forgot... half. And there's already... The... We're on floor one. Oh, forgot... God. Yeah. All right, I'm just going to... I'm going to use uh, Misty Step real quick. Okay. Did that cast. Um, roll That's fine. I know what Misty no. Step does. But yeah, so 30 yeah. feet. Where do you want to teleport to? I'm gonna teleport to here. Okay. Okay. Yes. Wait, where are they? Did I go too far? Uh, nope, you didn't. <laughs> now you do oh, still yeah, have just, like, a far away. still have 30 feet of movement, and if you wish to make up that ground, you can use your action to dash. But that is up to yes. you. How much do I get to use for a dash? Is it 30 feet as a dash? Uh, no, if you dash, it doubles your movement speed. So you would have 60 dash feet. Dash is using your action to move again, yeah. Okay, uh, so what would my movement speed be with dash? 60. All right, I, that would end me up here. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey guys. <laughs> Fritz help. Uh, I, I, I can't do much. I used all my actions and bonus actions, but I'm here. Good job. I'm here in spirit. Thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> Moral You're support. You're doing great, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't die. I'll help you. Lyra, your turn. Okay. I have 40 feet of movement in my current form. Uh, so I'm just going to... 25, 30, 35, 40. Okay. Uh, dash action, I guess. <laughs> 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, 75, 80, and that's all I got in me. Buck, you're being battered by a bunch of stone defenders. Um, I'm gonna have to attack while I can so I can stay within my rage. Mm -hmm. So 
I am gonna try and hit some of these smaller ones. So here's what I do. I'm gonna attack recklessly. Okay. I'm gonna first get a smack on this one here. Uh, hold on. Where's my... Yes. Ooh, yeah, that'll hit. Uh, and that's 17 damage Okay, on this yeah, one. this one just falls apart. Boosh. Um, I'll do another hit on this one that's above me that's already hurt. Okay. Yep, that one will fall apart as well. And then I will use my bonus action for my rage ability to go 30 feet. I'll go here. I still have 50 feet. I'm gonna... Now, does that prevent attacks of opportunity? Um, it's automatic teleporting, generally. Oh, in teleport, D &D. never mind. Yeah, I'm, te I'm like, uh, teleporting. So I generally see. teleporting does not provoke yeah, opportunity yeah, yeah. attacks. I thought you were running. Um, unless they have, but they might have something special. I don't know. You see, I'm a very bad uh, listener. <laughs> that's okay. Uh, it's like a weird wild search thing. Then I'm going to use the rest of my movement to come down over here. Um, <laughs> by Cue Han Solo running away from all the stormtroopers. <laughs> yeah. uh, and I will end my turn putting myself, I guess, where I've placed myself. Okay. Next are the constructs, and they're going to see where you went and see the bear and Aarakocra, and they kind of put their hands forward as well and start marching towards you. Please do not resist. And they're going to march forward right here. Just <laughs> do not resist. Let us kill you peacefully. This one is There's no rule that says here. a bear can't be in a library. <laughs> Discrimination? It's right over here. Do you have any, book, any books on being non-discriminatory? Now, yeah. these, uh, this one is going to launch another orb at you, Buck. Make a constitution saving throw. Constitution saving throw. And this is with okay. plus five, you said? Uh, mm -hmm. yes. Okay, so be you, sh 18. you shrug this one off as well. They really want to capture you. Uh, yeah, and one more, since this one fires they, uh... another one. Oh, uh, one more. Mm -hmm. Give me one second. Are they doing that at disadvantage because they're in melee range of me? Uh, uh, no, or? because this is a special feature. This is not a... I'm, ah, cool. I'm going to use attack. one of my... Your luck points. Lucky points to reroll. All right. Keep them there. I got a plan. <laughs> oh, dang. All right. Okay. Okay. You guys see Buck run away as these guys march forward <laughs> and <laughs> fire some orbs, and he gets trapped like a hamster in a ball. <laughs> Doesn't yeah. your current wild surge allow you to teleport? Yeah, I can teleport up to 30 feet. Okay. I don't know if the orb teleports with me. That I do not know. So. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I guess we'll find out. <laughs> and you see like a ethereal chain between the orb and this guy. So you got, you are also chained to him. So I'm going to put a little, uh, put a little chain. Boop, little chain. And the stone defender is going to uh, stop chasing towards Buck and look at you, Lyra. And it says, no animals on the premises. <laughs> and it's going to attack you. Discriminatory. They are discriminatory. I knew it. Certified yeah. service animal. Yeah. This is my emotional support bear. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, words, yeah. I'm words seeing eye bear for when he needs to read. <laughs> He keeps me safe from the men that hide in the forest. Okay, it is going to slam you once. You're going to take 10 bludgeoning damage. Oof. Oh, oh my bare body. Okay. This one is out of range. And yeah, that will be the Construct's turn. Word. Oh, Lord. All right. I'm going to oh, scooch Lord. over here. Okay. <laughs> um, can I make a use my bonus action to make a stealth check and then continue moving? Yes, I would say so. Cool. Your cunning action. Stealth. Yes. yes, you are hidden. Woo. <laughs> All right, I guess I gotta shoot again. Now, don't I? Eh. Eh. Oh. Ooh, all right. Which one are you <laughs> targeting? That one? Okay, yes. It fires in, it pings off another big chunk of armor. Take it, you fool. Oh, no, he knows I'm here. <laughs> Right, I think that's all my movement. Okay. How could he have that's, detected my presence? Know, that's my turn. Yeah, just launching tiny little huge meat chunks off. Fritz. All right. Um, I'm going to load up and use my final sh sack shackle shot. Ooh. So I no longer have Ooh. these. Okay, one size larger, um, or at least one size smaller. 
Okay. Ooh, I'm firing 15. at this guy because I'm pretty sure it will grab a lot of people around him. Um, and it can only grab one. Yeah, it can grab one. It What's will grab the... someone. Mm -hmm. Which one are you targeting for it to grab? Uh, this one. But if I, I'm pretty sure it could push them back, and it would just attach onto others. Of my misunderstanding. Uh, it it basically lets you shoot one guy to attach them to a guy behind them. So yeah. If, so I'm, I'm attaching to the guy behind him. Okay. Triple sh triple shackle. I, yeah. Yeah, because he's bigger, so it should attach to the small guy behind, mm -hmm. right? If I'm understanding. Yes. If if your attack yeah. lands. Yeah. At most, one size larger, one size smaller. Yep. So this guy, I'm going for. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. uh, that hit is not going to be enough as it just bounces off of the armor, and the the shackle uh, shot just. Can I, can I, and it's it's gone. It missed. Mm -hmm. Bugger. I fucked it. And I don't have any inspiration. No. <laughs> okay. um, you do have a you second, have a second attack, attack, though. You can just fire to do damage. Mm -hmm. Do. I'm seeing if I can do anything fun though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I guess I'm just gonna fire at him. Ooh, once again, pings oh, wow. off of the armor. This is some hefty dudes. I've used all my good rolls. <laughs> no. Barely, Ruff. Um, oh, wait, are, are you gonna move at all? Actually? Uh, yes. I did want to move a little bit. I'm gonna move back 15 feet. Oh, wait, how far is it? 15 feet? Oh, okay, there. Dude. <laughs> oh, uh, you good? I don't, no. Yeah, I don't think it saw me. <laughs> Not the I'm best. Gonna, make me I'm a gonna, make me a stealth just... check. Uh oh. Oh fuck. <laughs> Level one of five, baby. There's it's okay. Like I'm actually pretty stealthy. Never no. mind. I'm not that stealthy. <laughs> you hear off in the distance, uh, all of you. Please do not resist. Oh, it's another <laughs> big one. Mm. Cool. Okay. Anything else, Fritz? Do you want to move back? Uh, uh, fifteen. <laughs> I'm gonna move back behind the shelf here. Yeah. Suppose, huh. Quick question: How like high is the ceiling in this place? I would say the ceiling is about fifteen feet up. Okay, that's not as much vertical clearance as I wanted. <laughs> I'm so sorry if I made you jump with my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All good. Have you ever heard of kiting? Where we race them in circles around the library, launching tiny little arrows. <laughs> bear Lyra, you're finally gonna get to be a bear at something. Hopefully. Okay, uh, yes, I would like to multi-attack. My bite and claw attacks both have plus six to hit, so I'm just gonna roll d20 plus six. Uh, what are you uh, targeting? I am targeting the big boy right in front of me. All right, cool. Whoa! Yeah! yeah. All right. Yeah. yeah. First okay, so that land. means the bite goes. Uh, so that is one d8 plus four piercing damage. Let me just roll that in as well. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Uh, okay. So that's eight for the bite and for the claw. That is uh, another plus six to hit. So one d20 plus six. Come on. Oof. Ooh, no. Does that, that unfortunately is not able to pierce the armor. Let's see, do I have any inspiration? Because I would really like to smack this guy. <laughs> hmm. Doesn't look like it. That's unfortunate. Mm, all good. But a good hit nonetheless. Yeah, but the, but the claw does like 2d6 damage. <laughs> oh, damn. It does more. 2d6 plus 4, sorry. Um, yeah, okay. Well, that's all I got. Okay. Uh, Buck, your turn. You are in gay baby jail. I'm in baby jail. I'm Little going to orb. try, try as I might to teleport out of baby jail. Okay. Uh, you teleport. Where do you teleport to or where are you aiming to? Uh, I guess for like uh, over here, I guess. It's getting Okay. Blanking. You teleport no, over mind. there and the chain is still there and you are still inside the orb. No. Uh, can I try to break it out of the jail? You may. Uh, how, what should, can I, I'm gonna try to just use raw force to, to get out of it. Uh, yeah, try it, go ahead. Uh, with an action to do that? Yes. 
And because I'm still raging, uh, it should be a strength. I should have advantage on strength. Mm -hmm. And then plus two as well. With, uh, or is it uh, just advantage on strength? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's okay. 17 plus uh, seven. <laughs> Woo! Oh, all right. So you start pushing with all your might. It's just enough space. Uh, in fact, the claustrophobic space actually gives you a lot of room to push as a result, <laughs> ironically. And as you're pushing with both your hands, you can see the orb is starting to crack on either of your palms. Are you like monkey balling right now? <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Cool. Uh, but it hasn't broken, I'm still- Not here. yet. Okay. Uh, I will say that can take one of your attacks. And then I guess I'll use another one. Uh, you may, yeah. Ooh. Oof. Uh, That's I, with a plus I, six. Seven. Can I hold on before? Seven? It's oh. plus seven, okay. but, but. I have my, la I have my last uh, lucky slot. Mm, yeah, I'll use it. All right. Last lucky slot, so let me roll again. I guess I just need to roll one more d20, not mm -hmm. two. Uh, fuck. <laughs> Ooh. Lady Luck has it out for you. Yeah, yeah so it's still a 15. Mm. What'd you say? It you was still 15. Yeah, yeah, still 15, but you haven't quite burst through this orb. But you feel as though some nice supporting force might do it. Or maybe the next time you try. Okay. I'll end my turn. Okay, next is going to be the constructs yet again. Oh boy. And let's see what they do. Uh, this one is going to launch an orb at you, Lyra. Make a constitution saving throw. Ah, oh, beans. Okay. Uh, <laughs> plus three in bear form. Uh, I'll right. just do that. Uh, I'll just, I'll, I'll hit it, and then we'll just add the three in post. So that's 14. Okay. You just barely manage to... Uh, Aha! burst out of the bubble. Uh, for a split second, you look like a little gachapon bear just in, like a, <laughs> rolling in a thing, but you gnaw your way out of it. Lyra thinks but does not say, sorry to burst your bubble. <laughs> and so uh, the rest of them are just gonna beat on you. Oh, good, great, amazing. Let's see. One misses, one hits, two hits. They just start slamming with their mechanized arms it's not a great time no Ooh, you are going to take 15 bludgeoning damage as okay. these three are all battering on you i am still a bear it's still just a bear just barely uh-huh <laughs> okay you, you hear stomping <laughs> dun, 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 oh, as no. there's another one that comes out from this room and says animals are not allowed on the premises I'm j literally just sitting here. <laughs> Where's one to read? <laughs> Looks like it's up to me again. <laughs> and I'll uh, be a cheeky little mother. <laughs> I'll sneak back over here. I'll take the stealth action. I, I feel like it's fair this only works once. Nah, it works again. <laughs> Woo! You are hidden yeah, one, yet again. Little another little pop shot. That. Yeah, another pop shot. With advantage, out of stealth. Oh yeah, yeah, and this one just oh! falls to pieces. It gets yeah. ready to fire another orb at Lyra, and it says, "Animals are," and it falls apart. Yay! Animals are sometimes my friends, and sometimes me also. And then I'll talk back here again. <laughs> Fritz. will be my turn. There's a drone hot on your tail. Yeah, that sure does seem to be. Um. <laughs> Uh, you know what? Um, oh, I'm, I don't wanna, I don't wanna. Uh, I'm scared. I don't know how far his reach is, so I'm scared. Um. I will say you are within melee range, so moving out of the way will pro provoke an attack of opportunity. <laughs> okay, then. Right. But we just um, learned that you I can, you can fire your ranged attack. Together. Without disadvantage, because yeah. even though oh, you're within five I feet, know, you have that but thing. I want them away from me. <laughs> um. Okay. Where is this? Uh, like. 
Oh, I probably they're probably really strong, so I'm scared. Yeah, they're they're pretty beefy. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna have to. I'm declaring my bonus action as the. Oh wait, I could just blip out of existence for a minute if I wanted to. You could. <laughs> to get away. Yes, you could also misty step. Mm -hmm, but I don't want to use a spell slot. I could do this without using a spell slot. That is true. That is also true. Um. All right, I'm going to blip out of existence. Okay. All right, ethereal. So... Doo -doo -doo. So... My usual movement is 30, right? And so you have... Half. Yeah, you have 15. 15. All right. I'm going to get myself... So in the, in the ethereal plane, when you reach there, things, you know, and your vision kind of goes a little gray, uh, you notice that the walls exist, but the bookshelves do not. Oh... Hmm. Because okay, you're, well. it says that you're not affected by other creatures. Wait, hold on. Only affected and be affected by other creatures on that plane. Um, all objects and effects that aren't on the ethereal plane. Yeah, so the bookshelves are not on the ethereal plane. The walls are, though. So you can move through the bookshelves if you want. But I only have 15 feet. You do, yeah. So... Yeah, I would still end up on the... Okay. You do I'm have your your a full action to dash as well if you want to get back to your normal movement. I kind of want to hit him still. Um, All right. I think it went... Can you do that when what? you're ethereal? Let's see. Uh, the spell well, has no... Well, I can get out of it. I'm pretty when sure the... I can get out of it whenever Let's I want. Let's see. Uh, I might have to use, like, a bonus action or something. When the spell ends... So I'm trying to find, to, yeah, I'm trying yeah, to find up where, to eight hours. Up to um, eight hours. So it's a, uh, is this a concentration um, spell? Uh, it is not, no. It is not a concentration spell. Oh, so I can so just fun. choose when I come in and out. You remain for the duration or until you use your action to dismiss the spell. Okay, so you would have so to you use have an to action. use an action. So ethereal step is different from etherealness. They're different spells. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you would have to basically right, you, but it says it says eth the ethereal step. You cast the etherealness spell without expanding yeah. the spell slot. And it says oh, oh it's oh, but it oh, says oh, the spell oh, ends at the end of the current turn, so that's when oh, the spell. Ends. So it doesn't last go. eight hours. Mm -hmm. It lasts until mm -hmm. presumably you could use your action to dismiss it. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, since you've okay. already used your bonus action, or you could wait till the turn ends and you'll come out of it. What? What would my movement be if I did use also my dash action? It'd be back to normal, 30. Okay. It's so dash action doubles your movement. I could end up on the... Oh, I'd still be in a pretty tough spot. The tough um, light that we picked. Sorry, I got a bit confused by the discussion of etherealness and then ethereal step. I'm so confused still. It's okay. When you... So you're currently in the ethereal plane... You can either use an action and you will immediately mm -hmm. come out of the ethereal plane, or if you wait till the end of the turn, um, it doesn't say your current turn, so it might just be until the end of the robots are done attacking, okay. you'll automatically come out of it. So while you're in the ethereal plane, you can't hurt anybody, anybody, but you can use an action to like dash so you can get more movement, set yourself up to appear somewhere, and then at the beginning of Word's turn, uh, you'll come back into existence. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think I'm going to dash then. Okay. And I'm going to dash over here. Nice. Nobody suspects I a wanna, thing. I want to be closer to helping my friends. Nice. I'm behind a book <laughs> pile. <laughs> okay. Uh, lay bear. Mm -hmm. Lay bear. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Gonna try smacking this boy again. All right. Uh, Smack that boy. Okay. Once again, multi-attack. Bite. Bite. Okay. Plus six. Come on. Yeah, Yay. that'll do it. Let's see the damage. Okay. That is 1d8 plus four piercing. Okay. Probably All right. Not bad. And, and for the claw. Come on, please. Yay. Yeah, that'll do it. Yes. You're able okay. To pierce the armor. 
Great, so that is 2d6 plus 4. Oh, nope, that's not right. There we go. That's pretty good. Oh, that's pretty good oh, damage. Nice. Yeah, you Ha-ha. knock off a chunk of the armor. And yeah, you do a decent dent in this thing. It was not expecting to fight a bear today. <laughs> yeah, I mean, as we all know, no animals are allowed in the library. So. Oh, so they're not trained for it. Mm-hmm. Buck, yep, that's everything I got. The bubble is almost burst. I will use my power and I will try to break free. <laughs> I want to break free. Okay, yes. Plus that'll, seven. That'll do it. You, The bubble just breaks. <laughs> and uh, you are free. Do I still have one attack action? You do still have one attack action. Okay, I'm going to run over here. I'm going to smack a man. Smack a man. John I'm going to attack man. reckless smack a man. Call of Duty shoot a guy. That's not going to be enough, unfortunately. Okay, I'm going to use my bonus action to... Where's 30 feet? <laughs> Over here by my friend. Oh, yeah, because you couldn't get, like, double advantage or anything, right? Even though we're flanking. No, I can't. Yeah, I don't think no, so. that'll be plus two, and that's still not enough. Uh, I still have some... Uh, movement, so I'm gonna come over here closer to work. <laughs> the barbarian running away from the battle. <laughs> I'll come back in. I have the bonus action ability. <laughs> um, and then I'll end my turn because I can't really do anything else. Alright. Next are the constructs. Now, instead okay. of ganging up on Buck, they're gonna gang up on Lyra. Oh, oh no. boy. So here we go. <laughs> take quite a few attacks yet again. Yep, okay. Let's go. Although, uh, let's do these in order because my armor class is going to go up by one ah, if you true. take me out of my bear form. Okay, so this one's going to attack first, and it hits, uh-huh. so it's going to okay. deal seven bludgeoning. That That's me out of bear form. Okay, you're out of bear form. You're oh. back to normal So my form. AC is now 12. Okay, and the defenders are going to surround you. Yep. Oh, no. Let's see. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. All right, uh, the defender, the first defender is going to hit you for eight bludgeoning. Okay. The second defender is going to slam the ground. I'm going to need you to make a constitution saving throw. All right, this is plus two, even though roll 20 won't admit it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, you are only going to take three bludgeoning damage, and you are not shaken. You're not dropped to the ground. Great, amazing. And this one <laughs> is going to slam you as well. <laughs> and yeah, that'll do it, and... You're going to take an additional 12 bludgeoning Whew. as they are all surrounding you. Please do not resist. <laughs> <laughs> you know that JoJo gif where the guy's just getting absolutely kicked? Yes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. Word. Hey, don't listen to him. Resist. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. It's over to me already. I don't have any good items or anything crazy. So Fritz is uh, back into the, the plane. Yeah, yeah, normal plane. Mm-hmm. All right. But I'm behind a bookshelf. I'm sure this will conceal <laughs> my really big bird identity. <laughs> 25, 30. Uh, so I have half cover. Mm-hmm. Uh, if I used my bonus action to like try to hide again, would that function? Would that be okay? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okay. So long as you're slightly behind a thing, they can't tell like where yes. you have gone to as far as they know. So yeah, I'll say you're hidden again. Your attack has advantage right. once again. Out of stealth. Another bolt. The bread and butter. Oh my oh god. My god. <laughs> Which one? This one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's dead. It falls apart right in front of Lyra. <laughs> Woo! Whew. Get him! Holy shit. I am the accumulation of numbers. <laughs> Yeah, uh, that's it. That's all I could do. <laughs> Fritz, you come out of the ethereal plane to see Lyra back in her normal form. Okay, time to start blasting <laughs> this twenty. This this guy, you. Blast that guy. Do you, you wish to use your bonus action to mark him at all? Yes. All right. <laughs> Planar warrior is going to add an additional D eight if your attack lands. Okay, it is. Roll that D eight. Roll that D8. Okay, good. A decent chunk. You knock off like a piece of his chest plate. And I'm gonna hit him again. Okay. Yes, Ooh. that'll also hit. Yeah, oh, you're doing a decent amount of damage to this guy, just wearing him down. 
Lyra's still getting battered, though. <laughs> Lyra, <laughs> what's, what are your opinions on this? Not great, but now that I'm back in my real body, I'm going to cast Thunder Wave. Ooh, all right. Actually, is that the one that's better against contracts? Uh, I'm. I think Shatter is. Uh, I said it. Yeah, inanimate objects take double damage, but they're animate. So uh. it said it cast, and then it didn't show up in VTT. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'll just read it. A My wave apologies. of thunderous force. Blah blah blah. Each creature in a 15 foot cube originating from you must make a Constitution saving throw. Books. Um. There. Yeah. So that catches all three of them. Uh, yes. Okay. Books do go everywhere. <laughs> regardless of what uh, their save is. It's only a 15-foot cube. There's no books right in the 15-foot cube. Isn't there? Uh, No, like f uh, f ahead of me where the robots are. Oh, I, I see. I don't think I'm in the center of it. It's a 15-foot oh, cube. That... Oh, yeah, that's, yeah. I always I always forget how Thunder Wave is yeah. not actually like an AoE around you. It's actually a line. Which would be you. cool. Yeah, yeah. You like make a, I make a square. I make a square, and make then an everything in the square, square explodes. Oh my gosh, these um, guys are supposed to be good at this. They miraculously fail, all three of them. Amazing. Okay, so that's 2d8 thunder damage, and they're pushed 10 feet away from me. Let me just roll 2d8. Um, Ooh, eh, okay. Bad. Okay, you push these two guys back. Are the little guys still up? This guy back. The little guys are still up, but all three of them are now falling apart at the seams. Cool. Uh, Crush them. Crush them. Yeah, that was my action. Um, I don't have... Let me see what bonus actions I can do. Oh, yeah. Uh, for my bonus action, I'm going to shift to give myself 10 HP and slightly increase my uh, movement speed. Nice. Do you move at all? Uh, no, I think I'm good. All right. Well, actually... How many? <laughs> how much more should I be pretending I'm a frontline fighter? <laughs> um, tank, hmm. true, tank, true. I didn't turn you into a bear. That's true, it's <laughs> true, but I have been knocked out of bear form. Uh, okay, my movement speed is now 40 feet, so I'm just gonna be like, all right, cool, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, word. <laughs> oh, hey, what's up? <laughs> it's been a while. <sighs> Got 50 feet. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, your turn. Zoom. Uh, and then I've got additional movement, so let me go here. Mm-hmm. And then I'm gonna screw it. I'm attack recklessly on the big guy. Big guy, all right. And it's eleven. That's eleven. Yeah, that'll be enough. The big guy falls apart. Nice. Well and then I'll attack a smaller one. I guess directly below me. Oop. Uh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, that will do it as well. Last one and... remaining. Uh, I have a bonus section, but I don't think I can actually... Oh, no, I use my bonus action to yeah. teleport. Yeah, uh, I don't have anything else I can do, so I'll end my turn. Okay, next are the Construct's turn. This one is going to come batter at you yet again. And you tank it. You're totally fine. Yay! Word, there's only one guy left. Do us all a favor. Yes. Okay. Um, I don't know where they are, actually. <laughs> I'll uh, fuck once I find them. <laughs> when I find you. When I catch you, Ricky. Okay, I'll, I'll just shoot you normally. When I catch you, right. Ricky. Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. Oh, oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> you fire your only shot those wide. <laughs> you kill Buck. <laughs> <laughs> Die. And I mean, I'll Buck. take care of this. You destroy <laughs> the air crystal in this corner of the library. And... Nothing devastating happens, oh, but no. boy, does it get a, just that bit less comfortable here. It's hot now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fritz, your turn. Okay. Um, well, there's only really one guy left, so... Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Should I really condemn him? I mean, I could do it as much as I want. I'm declaring my bonus action thing of mm -hmm. force damage. All right. Ooh, not quite. This one goes a little wide. Oh. And right. it kind of glances off. There we go. Okay, that'll do it. Yes. It, as this thing is like sputtering and twitching, please do not resist. Please do not resist. Can I make some recommendation? <laughs> Explodes. <laughs> <laughs> I feel bad. <sighs> All right. Back in the library, you guys have destroyed a bunch of constructs. Well done. 
Um, <laughs> and you can see we didn't need to do any of that. that the Kitty widgets continue to reorganize and um, reassess the books and placing them in their spots since nobody is battering them with a hammer. <laughs> All right, we're safe. Now I have the space to ask a question. Why did yes. we fight those things? <laughs> well, the big ones were trying to fight us first. Ah, we're well, not allowed to be here. Then yes. Let's go deeper. Uh, well, that's what I was, I was just gonna say. Yes. Yeah, so when oh, you approach yes, there it is. this part oh, of the library, you can see that there are some arcane sigils blocking the way, akin to locked doors. All right. Mm, well, Give me a problem. sec. Uh, okay, I can only do this a limited number of times, but I do have to spell magic prepared. Mm -hmm. Can I pick up some of the screws from the... Oh, I, I can't remember their full names, but I picked up on Kitty. The Kitties. Oh, the the um, Kitty Widgets? Kitty yeah, Widgets. Kitty Widgets. Yes. I want to pick up some of the like pieces. I feel a bit bad. But yes. I, kinda, I don't know. I just want them. They're shiny. All right. Yeah, you can do that. I see. <laughs> like, well, not so Lyra, I you... add like a handful of scroll <laughs> screws into my inventory. <laughs> you wanted to do a dispel magic, Lyra? Um, Lyra? I can. Uh, the thing is, I only have three third level spell slots, so I can only do this for three of these. And I'm assuming that probably all five of them are locked. So it would be good to figure out if there's a an official Easy way to way. open them. Yeah. Uh, but we I'm, we have that in the pocket if we if we don't figure anything out before well, then. W one thing I wanted to examine is there was like a uh, there's like this little um, I just went to it uh, like a little ah yes that that is just a uh, crystal indicating the f uh, the table that is floating it is levitating uh, yeah, so just by like magical means that's those. all. Um, it's like an ashtray. can I did I earlier when I did the little magic did I get any sort of idea about what the the magic awareness. Whoop. Did I get it? <laughs> That's okay. I'll, <laughs> we don't have to go into it. Uh, and then we all did that. <laughs> so, uh, yes, getting magical awareness on that, you can tell that this is a one-way teleportation circle of some kind used to transport books into here for assessment and review and such and cataloging. Hmm. Um, also, I'm very hurt. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. If you uh, wish, you can take a short rest. Ooh, that might be a great place and yeah, time to do it. That might be good. But before I do that, I'm going to pull out my last gladiator donut and I'm going to look at all of you and I'm going to insert it in my mouth <laughs> like some sort of 1990s computer disc tray. I'm just going to like slowly <laughs> just <laughs> 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 And then okay. so let me roll a d6 so I can. Mm -hmm. Are you really that hungry? <laughs> I'm not hungry, I'm hurt. This has magical properties. Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. it's, not it's, not it's not great. It just goes crunch. It's not a donut that should go crunch. No. Uh, yeah, I could take a short rest. I'll raise you one buck, and I pull out my duelist eclair. Oh, it's no! Rock solid. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I could also Jeez. use a short rest if that's okay with everyone. Yeah, you may short rest and use however many oh, hit dice to recover. Oh, here. Just very. I just spend an hour with my tummy rumbling like, oh, why did I do that? Okay, cool. Uh, I'd also, if I can, while we're doing this, I'd like to try and like investigate the arcane lock, see if I can figure out anything about it, if there's a way to unlock it, or if I'm just gonna have to brute force this bad boy. I would say you could brute force it, but it's going to take you quite a few tries as, um, or get very, very lucky, as these are very high level cast, you can tell. Uh, can, I, okay. can I call out, do these things respond to us anymore, or are they all hiding and scared? Uh, not hiding, they're just uh, going about their business. Uh, you can call out to them. Um, they don't seem to react all that much to you. It seems that whoever commands them is far above, has permissions that you don't. Okay. They're just cataloging right. books, organizing them, marking them, putting papers on them. I guess, um... Now there is one corner of the map that you did not explore. Oh, not yeah, explore we territory, probably... you say? Mm -hmm. Is it bottom left? Because oh. I I went over top. there and- It is top uh... left. There's, 
Yeah, top, top left. left. Ooh. Oh, I thought They're you were just the same oh. place. Uh, <laughs> uh, I guess I was here. Uh, I no, it's okay. No, 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 no. Oh, did okay. you guys notice the guy? <laughs> yeah, that's I why I went earlier. Every I'm single person earlier. did the what, same thing. What is it that I'm looking at? Here? So, yes, Buck and the rest. Is that you a guys, man with a book face? You guys head into that room, and uh, right. you see. Hold on, let me see. You see some oh, small, small little construct. You find what looks to be a stack of books. Wear, uh, like, wearing a short, stubby, hooded wizard's robe with a massive zipper in the center and what? small clogs poking out of the open bottom. And it Please seems to be trapped this guy has a portrait. inside of a floating magical orb of some kind. And it calls, it calls out to you and notices you. <gasps> yes! No oh my way. god. Oh, I love him, I love him, I love him! Wait, hold on. for his rights. Wait, oh, Winrar? <laughs> so, yeah, no, Joe actually It's Winrar. Has. This is this is a I did not design this character. I stole this character design from at Spooky Stir Fry on Blue Sky, also known as Hampus Viclander, uh because like I saw uh Hampus Viclander seems to be what they go by. Uh they designed a Winrar wizard that I stole I for this campaign because I love their design so much. Thank you, that Campus is precious. Commander. I hope it's okay. I adore oh, them. Blue Sky. I love him. Yes, Blue Sky, yes. The Wizrar. So, hey. you see I they're- I didn't realize it was so similar to a certain thing. Wow, okay. They're, they're about three feet tall and the construct speaks, Hello, and welcome to Aguna's Grand Library. Could I borrow you for a little assistance? I seem to have found myself in a bit of a pickle. Anything Books you ask. That say what they have in them. <laughs> Word, you can come closer. It's not too scary. <laughs> I pull out my flame. No, no, no. I don't uh, trust a book. How did you find yourself in this debacle? Oh, well, ah, a long time ago. I, or was it a long time ago? I don't remember. Uh, I had this position here in the library to help people, and I did my job absolutely flawlessly. So flawlessly that no one ever seemed to say anything nice, like thank you, or good job, or I don't find you annoying. So, I think oh. the people who locked me up were just the meanest ever, and I, uh, if I ever see them again, well, I'm sorry to be so harsh, but I'll just have to tell them about how not very nice they are. My goodness. Can we adopt, same, can we, can we adopt them, please? Uh, yes. I'd like to attempt to dispel magic on this little arcane trap thingy they're in. Okay, yes, you may dispel magic, and yeah, let me just... we'll have to roll. What level? Uh, ooh, um, third. Uh, I, I don't want to burn okay. uh, my yeah, only remaining fourth level. That'll remove the orb completely as it pops. Boop. Oh, and... good. The uh, spell magic can't be cast below third level, so. Oh, okay, awesome. That's convenient. Um, uh, this I thing. Be happy to pay you exactly twenty nine gold. <laughs> oh it's... well, that would be very much appreciated. They've never paid me anything. Uh, but thank magic. you. You may call me the book tender. Right. Um. Are you a, are you books? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mean to be rude. Oh my mean god, to be but rude. you can't just are, ask people if they're books. No worries. I can see you are confused as to my creation. I am a construct, silly. A collaborative effort between the artificers of Palitrios and the enchanters of Aguna. I was first placed in the innovative arcanery competition of 128. Um, what year is it you now, know. DM? Uh, uh, today, this year is 253. It's been 125 years since. Oh, oh <laughs> buddy. I was created to help assist anyone who wishes to pursue the library in pursuit of knowledge. I am also fluent in over 40 different languages. He really got that, like, um, Kingdom Hearts style zipper on him, don't he? <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course. I'd be happy to teach Bertful. Uh, how about... Yeah. <laughs> Having soft tacos later. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> uh, we're actually currently engaged in a bit of a quest we're attempting to find our way to the lowest level of the library i don't suppose you'd be able to help us out oh yes actually i'd be happy to show you to that part of the library it has my best books like the and then immediately it's uh no, no. the belt around the book tender's head starts to glow and tighten muffling their voice uh. oh and also this one <laughs> and they have the best absolute best soup 
I hope it's still around. Fascinating. Uh, well, maybe you can just show us. We, uh, <laughs> that'd be easier. Well, yes, yeah, of in course. In the meantime, I, I waddle toward him and I pull out the little dictionary. Do you know any books that have these symbols in them? He leans down. I say he, they. They lean down <laughs> to uh, glance over the book. Oh, yes, I'm very familiar with this book. That is... <laughs> ah, that's what I thought. All right. Hmm. Lead the way. Of course. Happy to assist. And they float up gently and start to woo, kind of fly throughout the, uh, the library. The they are it's amazing. Great. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen. It's great. And uh, they fly forward, passing by over to here. And they go over to the locks. <laughs> I'm sorry about the Kingdom Hearts thing. <laughs> no. For security reasons, the teleportation circles clean. <laughs> the teleportation circles on the last five floors of Aguna's Grand Library only connect to each other, so you will have to find the next one. Fortunately for you, I am happy to assist. And they put up both their arms, kind of rubbing their hands together, put them on the arcane locks, and poof! They vanish. Hey. Whoa. That was impressive. Did we, did we lose Fritz? <laughs> Sorry, I was looking. I call so I was really engrossed, engrossed in the singing, and then just as we stopped singing, this popped up. <laughs> I was like, huh? <laughs> now, out of curiosity, and also so that I may help you uh, with uh, continue with what you're browsing and assist you even better, what are you looking for in the Grand Library? We have the name of the book, don't we? Um, that. Uh... The dragon told us to we get... the characters do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're I, looking the for the, was, the war with was... War with Deosia Volume with One, Deosia. Volume One, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, the is. original uh, unabridged. Yeah, yeah. First issue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll communicate that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and the book tender. Old book. The book tender goes. Oh, how exciting! I love history. Do you know the book? Actually, uh, sorry, that's a stupid question. You're gonna go home. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Yes, onwards. And it comes up. You notice that this, this book tender is very small. It's only about like three feet tall. I and love him so much. He's little baby boy. It Pocket goes. Size. He's taller than me. Shut up. <laughs> oh, really? Wow. Well, I said what I said. <laughs> well, word might have kind of a velociraptor stance. So, you know, maybe a little taller if you stand up straight. Oh, I do hope that someone comes so by to clean up this mess. As, he, like, as they pass by all the, like, broken down <laughs> constructs. <Oops. laughs> and you guys step into the teleporter, the book tender, uh, cast some kind of incantation on it, and you guys are taken zhoof, to the next level of Yay. the library. Yay! And you end up here, Ooh. and I'm going to say this is where we're going to call the session for now, as you are ah. now on floor 196 of Aguna's Glen, Grand Library. Ooh. I want to throw in, thank you, Joe, for being patient with us. No. It was almost overtly obvious that we were not supposed to spend <laughs> that much time in the first area. <laughs> hey, that's consequences of actions. It's, hey, you are a I, I worry that the pace slow down for you guys, but... No, oh, I we really were supposed to sneak past those time. guys, weren't we? I've been having a lot of fun. Just, yeah. It's nice to throw in these tiny gimmicks near the end of the story. Mm -hmm. Just us messing around. Yeah. yeah. 